out in one of our favourite fields and the wind has just got up actually. It's quite chilly. So here's the first target for me. Just see it down here, look. The greenage going on there. <laughs> Which would be helpful if I actually put it near the camera for you to see. <laughs> there we go, that's it there. So that was coming in at uh well first off it was about 16 18 something like that and then it dropped a bit i can't go get it out it looks like a button actually or is it not oh, or is it shotty it's a shotty shotty end lot there we go plenty of greenage going on there yeah ended up being about 14 15 when i uh pulled the cloth off the top and there we go so first one of the day, shotty end. Right, on to next. Okay, so, so it's ringing up a really high signal. That's it there, I think. Yep, there we go. So let's see what this is. <gasps> is it, is it? What is it? Oh, oh it's a cartwheel penny. It's not there, is it? Look at the size of that! Really heavy, definitely made of lead. Not sure whether there's any patterning on that. Some kind of lead weight, playing piece. Not sure. Massive. Thought I could see some like, outlines there. Some scratches going on, maybe. I don't know, I have to clean that up and have a look. But there we go, look at that, huge. Whoops, massive. Right, on to the next. Here it is, right on the very edge. I've been walking on the very edge here and here it is. Coinage, I'm thinking, but you never know, could be some kind of whoops button. Gosh, if that had rolled down the hill, <laughs> I would have been too happy. Look at that. Battered. Absolutely battered. Looks like all the edges have been curved up at the end as well. Look at that. There. Well, you never know. I always call these a George the Third because I just don't know, but it is very battered, isn't it? Let's see if I can lean up any detail a bit later. But there we go. Unless that was some kind of shank there. Oh, I'm not sure. There we go. Anyway, right. On to the next. And this is my next target. Now it's twinkling at me, isn't it? And you can just see it shining. Twinkle, twinkle, there we go. Not sure what that is. Thought I could see a little bit of a date. Might be a button, might be silver. Oh, who knows? So let's do a live reveal. I need to do this very carefully. Let's have a look. Very shiny. I think it's odds on button. And I'm right. There we go. Or is it? Yeah, I can just see. I think there, the remnants of what would be perhaps just there, look. The shank. But it's completely, completely gone. Just see it there, look, shining. There we go. And there's that bit, look. Isn't that cruel? So there it is, folks. My next find. And this has really made me giggle. It was right in there, look. That's how deep it was. There we go. Whee! Look at that. And that was actually ringing out a really nice signal. But it's really made me giggle. bit of farm machinery or something like that. Who knows? 
It's amazing what you find, isn't it? <laughs> right, on to the next. So, just under this bush is mosquito ball. There we go. That was a ringing in a 19, 18, 19. There we go, quite a big one. It's quite therapeutic actually doing that. So it's just sitting on this side of this hill here and hearing all the birders. There we go. Right, coming towards the end of our day digging. Had a lovely afternoon. Back to work tomorrow after the Easter break. So see if I can squeeze a few more signals in before we go. Right, on to the next. Whoopee! I've just got this out of here. Cleaned it up a little bit. There we go. Isn't it lovely? Half penny. St Edward. I was trying to look for a... Got carried away with actually cleaning it up. So, what's that say? 19... Oh. Sorry, the wind's blowing up too, is it? Wind's blowing a little bit on the hillside here. Something very therapeutic about sitting on this hillside here and just just rubbing this coin. Is that really sad? Is that a bit weird? I don't know. But look. Beautiful. Right, happy with that. I think I can just squeeze it in another another signal, I think. Another target before we go home. I'll see you at the next. That sky. Look at my hole. <laughs> I literally have just found my eddy half penny just here and just kind of the signal here. Uh, this came in as a 14. Not quite sure what this is. Could be a bit of trash. It could. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. It you see, I've never had one of these, but I know Henry's got one on here. It's a fibula, isn't it? it? Please tell me it's a fibula. Oh my god, it is, isn't it? Oh my god, oh my god. Right, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna pause there. I'm just gonna pause there. Okay, so I've just had it verified by Henry, who also found one of these on here. Early one. Um, and here it is. And yeah, he's a bit cross with me because that's where it was. If you remember seeing the footage, it was in there like that. And it must have, it was like that, I think. Hang on, I'm bring the camera down. So I think it must have been like that, Henry. And you can see where my shovel went like that. And I think I did that. So it's a bit cross of me because I think I've, I've bent it. Because you can see, look, right. some of that on there. But crikey. Look at that. This is my first one. This is my bucket lister, this where's, is. Where's your pinpointer? Um, I didn't need one. Where's it gone? Oh no, I've got it. I need it. Mm -hmm. I don't see the pins right. there, though. Just, uh, just pause. such beautiful weather I thought I would do my roundup outside so here we go right mishmash of stuff so I'll start on this side here of the lead items so of course we've got the musket ball and this is a weight as you can tell pretty fun that one selection of buttons just here and then over this side we've got an eddy 7 just here and this one I think is quite interesting. So it's a shove half penny. I think I've said that right. No, shove I haven't. Me. Shove it. What shove is it? Me. Shove eight me. I can't say it. I can't say it. Crazy. Eight me. Eight me. Eight me. Shove half penny, but it's, it's shortened down to shove eight me. <laughs> it's one of them anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so really interested. It's been uh, bashed around the edges really to make it uh, slide like that, playing in the game. Uh, so I'm led to believe. So that's that one, quite interesting there. Horse harness ring. And then of course, the absolute beaut, the absolute star of the show. And yes, I clunked it with the 
to about eight. Naughty me, but look at it, Roman fibula. That was on my bucket list. I'm absolutely over the moon. Look at that. Absolutely amazing. I never thought in a million years I would actually get one of these and be holding my own. But there we go. So, there we have it. My fantastic finds. I hope you enjoyed watching the video and watching me find my fibula. And this is Geek of Leaps, over and out. <laughs>